Hello Libra, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Libra. Thank you Lord God for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Libra, how you are coming to the reading is dark male okay um beauty queen very nice so um you've got somebody kind of looking over you stalking you they could be in the dark they don't want you to see that they are still pining over you um they're, they're not over you they could be looking in on your social media asking about you they're still around they're in the shadows in the dark you also could feel as if this person has like a dark side or dark energy to them in terms of just how they act sometimes or how they react um how you are showing up is living your best life um being on some type of platform getting a lot of attention um dressing well looking well just um being well the best revenge is living well so it looks like that is what is going on here for you because um how you're coming to the reading is uh, receiving a message that kind of inserts itself into your newfound freedom, life, lease on life, love for life. Um, it's a message of concern. This person may be saying things that they regret not saying to you. Um, they could be saying things, um, apologizing to you, wanting to reconcile with you, want, apologizing maybe for a third party, a third person, or interference that came in between you. And then they could be saying to you, being with you is awesome, Libra, okay? And now they're seeing the other side of not being with you, and it might not be so awesome. Your person that you're coming to the reading for is showing up as gifts and young male. Okay, so you could be dating someone younger than you, or this is someone younger than you. This is someone who is willing to shower you with gifts, anything to get you back, anything to get you to turn away from, to choose them. Okay, um, they could be a little bit immature, fast car, nice home, nice jewelry, um, into sporting events. They could play a sport professionally or not so professionally. Um, they're man's man. Uh, they're into competition, uh, showmanship, all of that. And um, it looks like they're, they're willing to give you anything to get you to turn your head, turn your head towards them. Your person is coming to the reading as um, family room. Okay, so they want to communicate with you that they want a family with you. They want to go to new heights, new levels in this relationship with you. They're asking you, will you have my baby? Not will you marry me, but will you have my baby? It's almost as if this person always wants a tie to you, a connection to you, a pull to you, a tether to you. And if that is another human being, they'll take it. They're coming in and trying to interfere. Once again, running interference. Um, the question their motive. Their motive is off. Okay, they may be operating from ego and fear fear of not having you ego of i've got to get her back i've got to win i don't want anyone else ever no one can win her no one can win him so the question their motive in terms of wanting you back or wanting to be with you because it looks like you have gone on a new journey here maybe you even got a new house you've moved on um, you feel like this relationship is taboo or it's just not approved of by other people looking out looking in on the outside because of something that someone else did or said, your person could be saying, wait for me, okay? Because they are absolutely addicted to you, wow. And now they're saying that they want to marry you, okay? And they find you absolutely gorgeous, beautiful. Um, they have things that they have not told you, and we saw that here with the three of hearts. They regret not seeing those things to you, um, those things that would um, make you want to stay. Your person may have to go through some type of litigation here, Libra, okay? Um, you're heavily in their thoughts, okay? And they hope that one day they can have that sudden wealth with you that is a family, that is a home, um, that is a life. 
okay? Um, they could give you some surprise message that they are arriving or they have departed from uh, one way of living or being or lifestyle or a person. They have left the relationship. I don't know. Um, the cards are saying ask others for help in terms of trying to figure out is this the person for you? Because in the near future, um, you may change your mind about this person. But you just need to get more information in terms of what it is they really want and what they have to offer you. Right now, you're just living your best life. You're getting lots of attention. And you just cannot focus. Right now, it's an absolute no. It's a no with an exclamation point. See that? So, um, let's see what this no is. Okay. What is this no for Libra? This could be someone you have children with also. This could be someone you used to live with. Uh, they want you back. They Question their motive. I don't know why they want you back. Okay. What is this no? What is this no for Libra? What is this no for Libra? Ace of no, no new start, no new foundational start, no engagement. Someone said no to the engagement because they knew it was false or it was falsehood. They can read this person very well. Interesting. It's like they said no because you will be engaged forever. The marriage wouldn't happen. It's almost as if this person wants to bait and switch or hook you. If this reading resonates for you, Libra, go over to the website. Book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Me a Coffee link. Um, you also can... Um, well, you can get in on the full moon uh, release ritual. If there's some things or people, places you want to release, you can do that. Uh, thank you, Libra. Many blessings to you. Take care.